Tell that smelly guard when you're ready. Hello there. Are you ready to begin? What exactly are the rules? The rules are simple. For a change, if you can stay dry, you win. I'm ready. Let's do this. All right. Let the duel of strength commence. I'm glad we can settle this like gentlemen. <laughs> Want to see if that feather can fly? I'll oop. One step closer to Squirrel Nation. I got you, Graham. One more horn to find. You should find a way to get all the horns. Questions? What do I need for the Duel of Speed? Bring your trusted steed to the tournament theater when you're ready for the Duel of Speed. 
You do have a trusted steed, don't you? Where exactly is the Duel of Strength? The Duel of Strength will take place on Daventry's own fantastical, wondrous floating island. Head north, then east. You can't miss it. Bye. Toodaloo. We won't take your money until we've done the job. Bring us something to house that candle, then we'll happily take your money. Now, give us one shiny gold coin and the beautiful blue flame lantern will be all yours. Thanks, dearie. And here's your lovely pumpkin lantern with a glowing blue flame candle. into a dark cave Bizarre holes were burrowed into the forest floor. Where do these holes lead? How'd my coin get down there?
Triumph? How'd you get up there? You poked? I did not poke! I went through that mess. That needs that. You you that doesn't need to be illuminated. Triumph's stomach seemed to have led him into trouble. I'd have to find a way to get him down. You poked? No poking! Stay put, I'll be back with help. Can we skip through this part? Too much walking, not enough dragons. Yep. Thanks for getting Ulfi out of there. That meeting was getting heated. way down there, I would be able to hear the password. Where do you keep going, Ulfi? Ulfi has very important business to attend to. Uh, have the croissants arrived yet? Oh, I already told you. I forgot the croissant, okay? Can we please move on from the croissant? Guys, I feel like we're talking in circles here. You think with his giant head, there'd be a brain bigger than a macaroon? Ulfi, you're so easily tricked into sitting down. You should stand up for our rights. Well, easy. But Alfie likes sitting down. Helps relieve pressure off my back. Look, Pilar, I'm on your side, but I need you to work with me. We need to build our bridges and get over this. What's a compromise we can all live with? Oh, there is no compromise. 
Those tiny ingrates go around stomping on the shoulders of giants with no thought as to who is underneath them. They climb the ladder of success. Ah, uh, jeez. I hope it's not a spy. The uh, next item is a Grand Counselor replacement. I have been happy to serve you, but as you know, I am going to retire next year. Me and the wife are finally going to have time to take up art classes. How cute. You want to be a drawbridge? Motion to nominate Pilar for the position. And now, Pilar, you know you can't nominate yourself. Uh, does anyone else want to nominate our fine Sergeant of Arms, Pilar, for Grand Counselor? No! I want you, Mr. Waddles. What's oh, this geez, doing here? Gosh, who would have thunk that an average bridge troll like me from a small town creek could grow to be the head of the second largest guild in the Midwestern Hemisphere? But it's time for me to suspend my work here and give my family the support Shortcut. they need. Shortcut. Brilliant. Let's move this item to next week. Next item up for discussion, should we lift our embargo on the consumption of goats? Ah. Oh. I long for the days of feasting on roasted goat leg with a nice aged raclette. <laughs> Pilar, everyone knows there are no more goats in Daventry. Only majestic unicorns. Next item up for discussion, should we lift our embargo on the consumption of goats? Oh, I long for the days of feasting on roasted goat leg with a nice aged raclette. <laughs> Pilar, everyone knows there are no more goats in Daventry, only majestic unicorns. Alfie, there is no such thing. That's what he had. I've seen him. Alfie. He pulled a fast one on you, you fathead. Well, everyone else calls them majestic unicorns. Ah, Alfie. If everyone jumped off a... well, my back, would you? Use your head and think for yourself. Or use your lips and close your mouth. Titwa. Okie dokie then. I think we should table this for next week. The uh, next item is a Grand Counselor replacement. I have been happy to serve you, but as you know, I am going to retire next year. Me and the wife are finally going to have time to take up art classes. How cute. You want to be a drawbridge? Motion to nominate Pilar for the position. And now, Pilar, you know you can't nominate yourself. You must now do the secret knock. Then? That is not correct, you spy. Who sent you? Larry? You'd think with his giant head, there'd be a brain bigger than a macaroon. Olfie, you're so easily tricked into sitting down. You should stand up for our rights. Well, easy. But Alfie likes sitting down. Helps relieve pressure off my back. Look, Pilar, I'm on your side, but I need you to work with me. We need to build our bridges and get over this. What's a compromise we can all live with? Oh, there is no compromise. Those tiny ingrates go around stomping on the shoulders of giants with no thought as to who is underneath them. They climbed the ladder of success and forgot who got them across their troubled waters. What's in it for us? We will show them all what happens when you... Hurry up, 
up, Goosey. Alfie has to get back to the guild meeting. He is a weak link. I wish Alfie would stay put. This meeting is already way over schedule. He'd better come soon. What is the knock? And the password. Trust me. <laughs> Très bien. Alfie, I am going to have to ask you to please remain in the meeting until we are done. As long as I know the secret password, you still have to let me in. You must now do the secret knock. And... 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 Now, speak the secret password. Um... Trust me? That is correct. Hold on. Hey, you. You don't look like a troll. You look like a scab. And I love the taste of scabs. Mmm, delicious. He's no scab. He's a goose. And Ulfie's friend. Let him in, Pilar. He might have our snacks. Any friend of Ulfie's is... usually make-believe. Oh, well, I am actually an imaginary friend. You are? Then how do we share a pie? Well, I didn't actually eat any of that pie. So, see? Imaginary. Ha! Imaginary or not, only trolls are allowed. Right. Well, in that case, I'm an imaginary troll goose. You are? Why didn't you just say so? Well, I, 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 I know that often bridge trolls from different regions can sometimes be at war, and I'm just here passing through. And or not, you must prove you are indeed a troll. Why don't you join me in the secret dance of the Bridge Troll Guild, and we'll find out. You are a scab. Nyam, 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 nyam. I somehow doubt. Yeah. Oh, uh -huh. can't stop. All right. Well, there you have it, Pilar. He sure does seem like a troll to me. Mr. Bridge Goose representing Ludor, on behalf of myself, the Grand Counselor of the Daventry Bridge Troll Guild, I would like to welcome you to our chapter meeting. It'll be wonderful to have an outsider's opinion on our strike. As long as he sides with me, it will be wonderful. Since I am sick of supporting the people of Daventry, I have collected all of the troll horn mouthpieces. They cannot be used anymore. 
Golly gosh, Pilar, that... that seems a bit extreme. Not extreme enough. We need to destroy these horns once and for all. We need to make a statement. We are not at their beck and call. Daventry has burned their bridges with us, and I will set fire to all these horns. Um, where are your horns, Pilar? Mine are already up on the hill where I will take all of these. Everyone will be able to see them burn. You, newcomer, throw in whatever is used to summon you. You are a part of this. How cute. A little bridge bell for a little goose. Okay, well, uh, according to the agenda, uh, the next line item we need to discuss is our negotiation tactics. What is our strategy for getting those guards to stop stomping around on our backs? Oh, 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 they should cross barefoot without their sharp heels. I think we should feast on their legs and force them to crawl over our backs. Okay, now, both interesting perspectives, I hear you, but we gotta find a way for us all to be successful. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I think I'm with Ulfi on this one. <laughs> Thanks. Good thinking, friend. A point taken. Moving on. Switching topics. Ulfi, it's your turn to bring the snacks next week. Do we want sweet or salty? Ulfi loves the taste of sweet. Ulfi, you are an unrefined swine. Savory is the only snack accepted by my palate. You both bring up good points. But we have to come together on this. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I have a little sweet tooth myself. Mmm, sweetie cakes. A happy tum-tum makes a happy friend. Okay, continuing forward. We need to decide on our team jackets. The tailor cannot wait any longer for our final decision. Ulfi is a fan of the majestic unicorn and butterfly logo with the slogan Building bridges to the future. No. Our jacket needs to be exciting. We should go with something epic. Something that will burn into their minds. We should go with trolls eating humans. With the slogan, Feed the Trolls. Okay, okay, those are both great points, but we really need to find a side to align on and work together. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I'm gonna go with Ulfi on this. I love butterflies and unicorns. A bridge to friendship is the best way to solve this. Next item, negotiation tactics. Getting guards to step softly across our backs. Make them walk barefoot. Eat their legs and force them to crawl across. Guys, I feel like we're talking in circles here. Pilar is right. Merci. Moving on, switching topics. Uh, sweet or salty snacks next week? Oh, sweet. Salty. It seems like we're circling around the same arguments. Salty. Oui, oui. Okay. Team jackets. Which direction should we go? Butterflies and unicorns. Epic. Trolls eating humans with the slogan, Feed the Trolls. Haven't we already decided on this? Pillar! I knew it. Next item, negotiation tactics. Getting guards to step softly across our backs. Make them walk barefoot. Eat their legs and force them to crawl across. Guys, I feel like we're talking in circles here. Pilar is right. Merci. Moving on, switching topics. Uh, sweet or salty snacks next week? Oh, sweet. Salty. It seems like we're circling around the same arguments. That's it. Waddles is right. We're repeating ourselves. I'm taking my horn and leaving until you sort this out. Don't go, little buddy. If you change your mind, we'll still be here. I left that meeting with two of Wolfie's horns. I didn't know if I was any better off than when I started. Nearly there. What's the password? 
What do you call a bridge to a pottery shop? A bridge to stoneware. A failure. Leaf. Vaton. The uh, next item is a... And lastly, what's the password? Um, trust me? That is correct. Hold on.